you all know how important Sandy Jardin was to this football club, to us all, all members of staff, players, team, every every department. Um, you know, a fantastic uh, father figure he was to us all. Very, very sad loss, obviously, to his family, and that goes without saying, but obviously to everybody else at the football club. And I just think it's a, a very fitting tribute um, that the club um, and the family are allowing us to, to, to name them stand um, in honour of, of, of Sandy and the wonderful, wonderful work that he uh, that he carried out for so many years at our football club. Of course, his passing and then uh, the, the decision to, to name the governing stand after him, it means that future generations of Rangers fans, they may well have learned about Sandy anyway, but uh, they'll, they'll now ask their parents and their grandparents who was Sandy Jardin, and in that sense, his name very much uh, lives on for a very, very long time. Of course it is. You know, we, we've, got, we've had some absolutely unbelievable figures at our football club, you know, for, for 140 years or so. You know, and Sandy's right up there with, with the best of them. You know, John Gregg, Bill Struth, all these guys, Willie Waddle. You know, <coughs> and, and Sandy, without doubt. And you're absolutely spot on. I don't think Sandy's name would would ever ever be forgotten, but it certainly won't. There's no chance of it happening now with us. With us certainly, that what we feel is a, a fitting tribute and an honour.